let me start off let me start off by saying thank you for watching my channel but but because you do not like the videos regrettably you don't get to see more of them because if you don't like my videos you're not going to be fed more of them and i post a lot so welcome to the boat ramp my friends my name is alfred montaner and you want to watch me at the boat ramp talking chit and this is a chit show video meaning i speak oh boy i see a chit show here what is this oh no we just had the turtle team here cleaning up the boat ramp let me see if i can get somebody to come and and help out with that guys oh that is tragic to see that oh i just i just also saw my baby cuda a little while ago and uh she's around and she's getting bigger um there's got to be growth hormone in uh in the water or something but she's huge i was surprised how big that uh hold on we got some people coming in guys we're at the boat ramp i know you guys been wanting chit show footage and uh, you love the no commentary stuff and I'm gonna make I'm gonna make no commentary uh, videos guys you guys have options now wait for it welcome back good how was the water out there man it's hot though it's very hot oh man so guys uh, currently it's about 100 degrees down here in South Florida I think the Feel. there's a heat advisory I think it was 115 or something 110 or I don't know but it's it's crazy crazy hot over here for South Florida and you know we got that humid uh, so ladies bring uh, bring the best hairspray you got when you come out here to Miami because you, you're gonna need it you're gonna need it oh boy this guy's coming in nice and slow you, you know listen um, People that come in nice and slow, most of the times they don't mess up. He's going in on three. He's good. They're, they, they got they, they got this. Oh boy. Yeah, he got it. We got we got we got people starting to come in. I don't know. Um, we just went live a little while ago. I know you guys love the lives. We went and we did a chit show interactive. Oh boy. The tree of death is deciding uh, to make a scene. We're going to have to have somebody crash into the uh, tree of death. I mean, guys, that's how it's how it, it honestly happens like that. Um, it really does. People actually cut, crash into the mangroves all the time here. Low tide. Very, very low tide. Look, let me show you how low it is. Look at the boat ramp here. I think we got a candidate over here. I might have to go a little lower. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to go lower. nice and slow the, the, oh the whiskey whiskey reverse whiskey but it, but he was sabotaged by the right leg of that soccer player but we got a side dock in the works or a man in the water which one's going to come first over the bow uh oh somebody's out he's good he's good he's come bringing it back guys it takes a it takes a village it takes a uh oh there it is and they're back but do they lose it back there's the lines my goodness my friends it actually materialized better than what we all expected this place is this place is special uh you know it's special the boat ramp uh lobster season is open people have been catching lobsters we got captain abel uh bringing in lobsters guys and he said that he's got 1,200 traps out there now. Or some crazy number like that. I, I mean, don't quote me, but it's a lot. 
He's like, I'm going deep with lobsters. So interesting. I can't wait to go back uh, and do another video. And if you didn't see the video that I did with Captain Abel, it's a great video to watch. All right, we got we got sheer panic here because of the low tide. Guys, low tide, angle, wet ramps. Bloop, 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 bloop. It'll get the best of you. Snake gate is still in uh, session, by the way. I know you guys are worried about the snake that lives uh, right here, right next to me somewhere. But yeah, the guy uh, decides to just uh, do a snake dance right behind me and Daniel every now and then, so. Oh boy, there's an argument over here. I told you, she's saying, I told you. The words I told you are not supposed to be mentioned on a boat ramp unless you want to have a, a successful relationship. She says it's not centered. The boat is not centered. He's saying it's not centered. There's, there's communication here, guys. She is the middle woman of the conversation here. Oh boy, this is gonna get good. The boat is crooked. All right. We, we, we ain't getting out of here until, until the fist fight starts, my friends. I told you so. Oh man. Oh boy. You know how it is sometimes. Uh oh, the lines are in. The lines are thrown in. They're not risking the truck. She said, I told you so. And uh, I don't know. Let's see what happens. We've had set scenarios like this in the past, guys. We're not moving from here. All right, he's putting a, a little throttle. He's scared to bloop bloop the truck. That's why he's he's having a little truck problem getting the the boat positioned right because he's not willing to let it float enough. So there's consequences to avoiding the bloop bloop bloop. It's called, I told you so. I told you so. Should we get a I told you so hat? Honey, I told you so. I told you so. You know what I'm just thinking about right now? I'm thinking about Fred. Um, Daniel saw Fred about two days ago and uh, he was hungry. Hungry. Very hungry. All right. Um, we might just be here four hours, guys. This might be a long, this might be a long video. You might as well go get a cocktail because this might end well. It might not. I don't know. It might nothing happen. I just want to see what she says. I want to see how she directs the conversation here. She's really engaged. She's saying something, but I can't hear her with my 45 year old ears. It's 46 actually. I just turned 46 August 2nd. Great day, by the way. Good time with family. Come on, man. What is going on over here? Are you guys going to do something or what? He's at the bow now. He's he's examining the chittery. Press the brake and put her on drive. That's what the guy said. Press the brake and put her on drive. There's definitely bloop bloop beer uh, fear here. Oh no! We got freaking Barcero music coming. You got to be kidding me, bro. Why? Why? We were doing so good. We were doing so good. Um, Oh man, all right, well, whatever, hold on. They're, they're not out of here yet, but let's, we're gonna see. We're gonna have to, the glass stream is coming back. Yeah, these guys uh, always play the music, so. But they don't have it too, too loud, so it won't be a problem. All right, but back to regularly scheduled programming. Hold on, hold on, let's see. He's going in, he's going in. He said press the, oh man. 
damn it. Out of all the places you can go, bro. Out of all the places, bro. Oh, well, this guy's gonna just go ahead and get the transfer of the Tratazo. There it is. Damn. The kid got uh, a, a little headbutt over there with one of the things when the, the dock hit the boat. But they're back safe, guys. Uh, little boy will be fine. He'll be fine. It's not there. It's not that bad. Yeah, you see they're distracting him. <laughs> they're distracting him. Oh, don't worry about it. Look, look at the manatee. You're concussed. I'm just kidding, bro. The kid's gonna be all fine. He's gonna be fine. He's a baby, bro. Speaking of baby, my baby coot has been around here somewhere. Um, I saw her earlier. Um, she was, oh boy, what is, what is this? What is this? Who's this? Who is this with this chittery over here? All right, we got some chittery coming in. Um, at the boat ramp, we got some music. What do you got there? Wait, wait for it. All right, what do you guys think? You think they're gonna make it to the chitter or not? All right, so I'm scanning the water to see if I see my Cuda, but man, let me tell you, I haven't seen her in a couple weeks, like two weeks maybe. And she looks big. She looks very, very big. She, she's gotten much bigger. Oh man, who's hauling ass? Dude, somebody, somebody, I feel somebody flying over here. What the hell? Oh, oh boy. Hold on a second, guys. There's a multiple. There's a multiple. Oh boy, this is going to get good. Hold on, guys. Oh boy, I heard I heard the whiskey drought over here. This might get this might get chinchoish. All right, this is whatever. This is, I mean, come on, a blind man could have saw this coming. But this, this, <laughs> a dead man can see this about to happen over here. Oh my goodness, wait for it. Oh man, it's it can't be this easy, guys. It can't be. This is like shooting fish in a barrel. Oh my goodness. Well, I mean, how do you pick? How do you pick? Which chicho do you want to pick? Um, I don't know. Wait for it. Oh no! All right, hold on, guys. Hold on. We got, we got, we got a quick pan. Quick pan. This is where, this is where the shot is. Oh boy. So far. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. So far. So far, he's not. He's not. He's not committing, which is good. That's good. He's going slow, nice, avoiding the chicho. All right, he's got this. Oh man, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong. But, but. All right, so the current is either pushing him to the dock. I don't know. Oh boy. There's a little, there's a little whiskey throttle in that one. What do you guys think? Do we have? You guys remember that Yamaha boat that literally took out a, a giant hole on the side of its hull? Yeah, if you missed that one, you're going to want to watch that one. I saw it coming like a mile away. Kind of like what I'm seeing now, but let me tell you, a lot of people saw that video and they learned a lot. There it is. They're back. And the cement. Uh oh, but it's in the water. Uh oh, but uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, there it is. There it is. We're fine. Oof. Oh, yeah. But the sabotage, the kickoff. Uh oh. The lady goes and stretches. She's in. She's in. Oh man. Let me tell you. And then guys, we'll have this guy later too. So we, we got we got a bunch of chittery going on over here at the boat ramp, guys. It's gonna be a long, a long day. Why are people beeping? Why are they saying get off my lawn back there? They leave the, the, the boat on? Oh no, well, actually look, they're, they're bringing it up. When this, that's actually courteous, right? There's, there's other people that can come behind you now. That's good. All right, guys, we're gonna stick around over here. We're gonna, we're gonna film an entire chit show. I don't know, it's gonna get wild. We're gonna have definitely more people coming back. I don't know, this is gonna get interesting. Wait 
Little McKee. Here's when the nerves start kicking in when you get closer to the boat ramp, low tide. We for it. Damn, that thing looks here. Has a 40 tiller? That thing must haul ass, dude, with a 40? Oh boy. Oh boy. Whiskey throttle. Bloop, bloop, bloop. I have the Chicho Blue song in my head, guys. I know. I know you haven't heard it, but that's a good song to watch. A little 40 on that, dude. Let me tell you something. I gotta I gotta find out. That, that 40 looks smaller than the 40 I have. I mean, I have a little older 40 that I'm planning on putting on the, uh, on the grandpa boat. But, yeah, it doesn't look that big. This one looks smaller. What is walking, what is walking inside the trees, dude? Is that a snake? Oh my goodness, between the snakes, the iguanas, the raccoons, the cats. I saw a lady feeding cats today in the morning. And um, there was a bunch of cats. But what I guess she realized today is that the cats don't eat the food. The raccoons do. So in like a matter of, no joke, like four minutes, she went to go put water for the cats. Or maybe she's a raccoon lady. Maybe she's not even a cat lady. Maybe she's a raccoon lady. Oh, look who it is! Hey. Dímelo! What's happening? Oh, hey, I'm, I'm, I'm filming, I'm filming at uh, Black Point right now. I'm, I'm actually filming, so whatever you say is gonna be on the chicho. Um, I can't, I can't stop, but the, the water's fucking hot. I, I need to go. Yo, are, are you, are you out in the water right now? No, I'm, I'm into the channel right now. I, I need to take this lobster. I'm doing two trips, I'm killing it. Oh, but are you even going to come to the ramp or no? Sweet kiss. Huh? I think you just got to get sick. Okay. All right. Well, listen. Uh, have to... Go, go, go. If you, if you got to do two trips, that's fine, bro. I was just calling to see if uh, if you had anything to show because we're here filming. But listen, say it say it anyway. Say from, from the ocean to your tables. Just, just say the slate. <laughs> you there now? I'm here. I'm here right now. I'm filming. Your helper was in the morning. I, 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 yeah, went, in, yeah. I, went, uh, I went at 8.30 in the morning with the, with the first slope. Yes, yes. So so I came right after that and I did a live. Uh, I came, I went live a little while and now I'm filming the rest of the day. So if, if you want to come by and show something off, we're here. I can't show it. I can't touch it. I can't touch it. They're fucking, they're fucking, they're, 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 they're delicate right now. The uh, water is uh, fucking uh, ridiculous hot. Okay, okay, okay. All right, well. Um, I'll be here if anything. Shoot me a, a, a call if you pass by. All right. Got it. All right, guys. Captain Abel over here at the boat ramp. Captain Abel. Uh, hey, guys, he's got a sailor's, he's got a sailor's mouth. I'm sorry. You know, he's, he was telling me about the water. He was telling me, Dímelo! Que on? Como? Good, bro. Bien? Little. Estoy ahí muriéndome con el pontoon ese. All right, guys. Um, we got over here. I mean, wait we. For it. <laughs> look, 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 look. He says, "Wait for it." All right, um, guys. You know we don't really talk about politics on the channel, but I do find it interesting that every time there's a Trump flag boat, all the Biden supporters went ahead. And and mention and comment. So here's your moment, Biden supporters or Trump supporters. Is there gonna be a chit show in the 
in the comment section. That's the question. Wait for it. Uh oh, Trump the Santis 2024? Would that even be possible? Would I would I, would that even be possible? Um and oh boy, we got we got some other boats right over here. Oh man. It's gonna get wild. Oh boy. Oh no. Oh no. It's it's gonna be a long day, my friends. It's gonna be a long, long day. So yeah, Captain Abel was telling me that the water is so hot and that's why he doesn't want to touch them. Because he wants to keep them alive. So he puts them in his tank so that people can get them while they're alive. Is that look at him right there? What it is done from the ocean to your table? I was just talking about you right now. From the ocean to your table, cold label, live lobster. I cannot show you nothing right now because the water is so hot. I cannot touch that lobster right now. But if you want something, call me 305. 9674343. We're gonna do a video next week. You know next week I was I was out on the I was yesterday with my, my with my boy fishing and I was kind of like by the keys and I was like I'm gonna see if I see you. Were were you working over there in the keys yesterday or no? No. No? No, I was doing I was doing Miami yesterday. So how many traps do you have this lobster season? Twelve hundred. Twelve hundred. Guys, that's your source for lobsters oh, down here in Miami. Whole week after 4 p.m., you can pick it up at the house live, baby. Live, <laughs> I gotta go. I gotta go. The water's so hot. Dale, dale, it's go. Degrees. I gotta go. So, gonna die. so, what do you do? You put them right now into the other tank, yeah, guys. He doesn't even want to touch them, guys. He doesn't even want to touch them. So, so if you guys missed, okay, maybe there's a lot of there's a lot of new folks on the channel, okay. Captain Abel is a local uh stone crab and. Uh, captain and, and lobster captain, and obviously he knows how to dock a boat. So, look, maybe you guys could learn something real quick. Um, he just actually repowered that boat too, with, with the Suzuki. Um, so I did a video with him, and we showed how he catches lobster here in South Florida. So if you guys wanna see a very interesting video, I learned a lot on that video, one of the things that I learned a lot, the most, I would say, is a trigger fish is deadly for stone crab and, and it's deadly for lobsters. Dude, I don't know how many, boy, some craziness going on over here. I don't know how many traps we picked up with basically um, lobsters being eaten by the trigger fish. Um, Ab Abel says it's kind of like, it's it's terrible. He says that that's a huge problem. Huge, huge problem. And if you guys don't know what a trigger fish is, it's basically it, it, it got teeth that look like a human. Like you pull back the teeth on teeth on a trigger fish, and uh, imagine imagine a human just biting into a fish to, to the to the to the crabs, and it just eats the shell. It's crazy. These guys are coming back. They already remember they, they were here in the part of the... But yes, that's a great video. Now you know if you want some lobster, he has them, guys. And he wants them. He wants you to buy them live, right? Because it's no fresher than that. Just got some two-strokes over here rattling. So he has to do two trips. And you know, okay, so let me explain to why he's doing two trips. I had this conversation with him the other day. So, you know, and I talked to, I talked to a lot of these commercial guys just because I want to learn and give you guys good information. Well, since he wants to keep those alive, he can't put too many of them in the tank because the water is so warm. So if he puts the same amount, I don't know if he told me 300 pounds, he would have to now put only 200 pounds and then he'll pick up another batch later. In this case, it's, it's the afternoon. Oh boy, this thing is getting, this thing is smoking out the neighborhood. Oh boy. It's a lot of smoke, dude. And it's only one of them.
Definitely running rich. You got a dad here with his two girls. Speaking of girls and dads, it reminded me of Mike Layton from Adrenaline Power Boats became a grandfather again because Anna Layton just had a baby girl. So congratulations to the uh, Adrenaline Power Boats family over there in uh, Georgia. Can't wait to see uh, how the future is now. You know, Anna runs the laminating department over there at Adrenaline and we've done boat, boats at, on the Reaper. And actually the baby was the first baby ever to rip it out of haul over in it with, uh, I don't know, six to eight footers. Um, and Anna was like, yeah, whatever. Yeah, nothing to see here. It's crazy. Oh boy, crazy as that, they're under the dock. Oh no, oh no, it was so nice. And that happened. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. It'll buff out, it'll buff out, they say, until it doesn't. Go, go, damage! Oh boy, uh oh, kick it off. The bystander helps. You guys remember um, the last time I was like complaining about two stroke motor? And I was like, yo, this is, I mean, I had inhaled a lot of two stroke motor. Um, and on that video, I realized I had caught Rona. Obviously, I went home and I was like, hey, I told my wife, I go, I, I don't know, this is, this, I don't think two stroke is going to do this to me. And then I went home and tested positive for the Rona and, you know, quarantine, did all that stupid stuff, you know. But, but I did it, whatever, you know, it happens. The kids had had it before. Um, it wasn't nearly as bad, so don't worry about it. It's not going to be terrible. So it was just a bad cold. And the headache, the headache, the first day headache was, well, well, and I thought, it was, like I said, I thought it was a two stroke. I'm sure the two stroke didn't help, but yeah. Man, this guy is really smoking up the neighborhood for real. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. You're such a hater, Alfred. No, I'm not, bro. No, I'm not. Fix your motors first and then worry about your thing, right? Get those things, get a guy like Rodolfo, a guy like K&J, a, a SOS over here down in Miami to go ahead and tune them up good so they're not making it. Mira, otro, otro, otro. This is a blown motor. That's a blown motor right there. I'm going to have to start going, I'm going to have to start going back to the boat shows and, and start talking about uh, engines and... <sighs> I'll tell you right now, the heat, extreme heat, Look at this! Made up ISO, bro. Congrats, bro. They're already dead, though. They're already dead. Normally, you can keep them alive, guys, but they're so hot. Listen, last last show I did, I, I did a video, and I have a good video on my channel. And so it's it's a little old because there's new engines and new technology, but it's there. Talking about upwards. Here's Abel. So if you guys want to see. That's his truck, and uh, you'll see it from the ocean to your table, call label. But yes. Yeah, you guys, you, trust me, before you spend anything, you make sure that your motor is good. And don't worry about all the other stuff, it's going to be fun, I get it, I get it. You want to make a scene out there, it's 100% uh, 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 understandable. But make sure everything is good, bro. Cause then a guy like me is in the mangroves and, and I film you getting towed back by Captain Lance. And then you say, no, he's not a hater. He was right. Damn it. You're becoming a monster. I've been a monster forever. He's got this, he's got this bro. And he's got lobsters on there. He's getting everything set up. Is there anybody on his side to help? No. Hold on, hold on. Yeah. 
he was good. He was good over here, guys. I, I, I kind of saw that he was going to be fine. That's why I, uh, I abandoned the shot over here at the boat ramp. Where's my baby Cooter? I know she was there somewhere. Why is this listing so much? What the hell? Oh man, I guess everybody's on, on one side. Oh great. Sea Chase was gonna shock kill right when we needed it the most. The most! And there it was. There was the hit. There was the hit and there's the chip choke. Oh boy, it's still in gear, opposite way. Oh no, oh no, it's getting worse. Oh no, get off my boat. Get off my boat, look at the people running. Get off my boat, whiskey throttle. Oh please, no, I work hard for this boat. Oh please. Oh no, oh no, please, please. My husband's gonna leave me if you scratch his boat. Por favor, caballero. It takes a village. Oh no. Hey. But whatever it takes, my friends, you did not witness anything that normally won't happen here every day on a daily at the boat ramp. A falcon coming back. Nothing to see here, guys. This captain has got him in check. Oh, I just heard somebody say relax. My watch is screaming at me saying move. Why? Why do I have to move? Have I not moved enough? What's up guys, welcome back. All right, um, well, I kind of have to disregard what I said. I, I might have been wrong with the uh, Falcon. Was I? Oh, was that a Chevy struggle? This guy, why is he throwing water on there? Did you see that guy just throwing water? Oh, this boat ramp. Those are nice looking boats. I like those Falcons, they look nice. And guys, those are power poles on the back. Basically, they're anchors that they'll anchor down in shallow waters and then, you know, you don't have to worry about throwing an anchor. You just press a button and anchor down. It's pretty cool. I should do a video one day about how that works. Man, this has uh, been a pretty long video. Dude, if this is how the Chicho is starting today, it's gonna be, it's gonna be, it's gonna be crazy. Welcome back, guys. Fred, where is Fred? Yeah, I don't wanna tell you. He's here. <laughs> don't fall in the water. <laughs> nah, Fred's not around. Not, not I'm, I'm sure he's around. Oh boy. Look, that dog will bring, that dog will bring Fred right there, right there. Come, come bring, oh boy, wait a second, what is this over here? Oh no. We got a rogue, uh, what, what kind of boat, uh, dog is that? Was it a uh, German Shepherd? Oh my goodness, the music, why bro, why bro, why, why, why bro, why, why the music bro, why, anything but the music bro. Oh, all right, guys. So I'm gonna try. Dímelo, estoy enfocado, bro. Dale, que voy para ti. Welcome to the chit show. ¿Cómo estaba eso? Pescaron algo? Yeah, it's been rough out there. Yeah. Bueno, dale, guys. Be careful out there. Cuidado ahí, que está la corriente dura. All right, guys. Um, that was at least the good thing about that. It's a tough. Music was put down and now we are um, not getting music killed. Oh boy. Okay. No, no, si estoy ahí, estoy ahí. Estoy. Oh boy. Esos son amigos amistad de ustedes. Pero yo vengo chicho también. No crea. Oh boy. It's funny when people make fun of somebody at the chicho and then they're next. They have no idea. They have no idea. Watch this, guys. It's them now. And watch, watch, wait for it. Watch. Oye, ¿qué tú crees? Oye, ¿qué tú crees de eso? Watch. That's a perfect setup. 
that's the perfect setup guys that's the perfect setup now watch this watch this watch this like your your yours truly touches the water and wait for it wait for it don't worry guys don't worry you guys are gonna get vengeance welcome back to the boat ramp <laughs> oh. I the chicho the chicho the chicho we're on the chicho guys we got a fountain over here all right they're next okay okay hold on hold on all right we're gonna get shot killed real quick but hold on they're, they're next they don't know they don't know what's going on yet guys but hopefully they get off uh, Oh, no, no, yo sé, yo sé, yo sé. Pero muévete para que yo lo coja. Muévete para allá, coño. Oh, my God. He says, just said, he's, he said, se va a meter por abajo del muelle. It means he's going to go under the dock. And he saw it coming. And I'm trying to get this damn shot. And he shot killed us. He shot killed us. Damn it. Wait for it. The waters have been zapped. Pero te estás riendo el otro. Y ahora no te va a perdonar. Ay, ay, que es esto, Dios mío. Pero como, oh, 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 shoot. Si no se tira, si no se tira el socio así, oh my goodness. That's why, guys, you can't be talking shit at the boat ramp. No te puedes reír de la gente en Black Point porque tú eres el próximo. Oh, all right, guys, well, listen up. Just remember. One day, I'm gonna film you hitting the dock at the boat ramp. I don't care how good you think you are. 